Welcome to Step Traders, guys. In this video, we will see how does order blocks works. In the last video, we learned what is order blocks and what zone we need to mark as an order block, which candle we need to mark as an order block candle for bullish order block and for bearish order block. But in this video, we will see how this order block works and how we can trade in forex with this order blocks and increase our probability of winning. So if for that we have the same chart and same candles here. Now we see this is our 15 minutes time frame and this is our order block zone and order block candle. Now we extend this zone. What we what is the use of this order block candle is like market makers or banks have the real direction of upside, but first they some they sell some of their orders here. So they need to close their orders sometimes before going to next higher high from this point before making next higher high from this point they first need to close the orders which is opening for sell at this range or they need to close at this range or at this range or in this range so they need to come and close and then make the next higher high in order to close that selling orders they comes down in this zone and then goes upside here they retest the order blocks comes down what is the logic behind retesting this zone they need to close the orders for selling which they open in this zone so they comes down close their selling orders then mix and buy another uh, orders from here they put the another buy orders from here in the same way in this was our one hour order block zone so banks will comes down in this point something like that something like in the exact manner then they will make next higher high from this point if we see we just make the next equal high here and this is our liquidity point they show that this is a equal high or a resistance then they will come down in this range and uh, retail traders will think that uh, price will support this uh, resistance here and comes down but this should goes upside from here and break the resistance in order to hit and grab all of the liquidity sitting above this line so this is how this should works but there is no such fundamental rule or universal rule that this order blocks will work every time this can violate here price can also go like this they can also go like this or they can also go like this as well in the one move there is no such rule that this will go upside from a hundred percent but there is probability that they will go upside they can comes down retest this order block and then go upside from here they can retest this order block and then go upside so they can retest at any order block but at order block once we have the order block price comes down now we will see in our smaller entry time frame that how do we react at this range how this price is working how this price is moving here and then we need to react according to the movement of price in current situation this is our zone where which we need to look for uh, our entry zone same in this point we mark this as our bearish shorter block so in this we will see when price comes in this zone how does price reacts in order to sell this is the zone where we can see to sell this is also known as supply and demand zone some people will call this supply and demand zone but concepts remains the same either we call it supply and demand zone or the order box this zone is exactly known as supply and demand zone and this candle is known as order block candle for bearish and bullish order block so this is for the four uh, one hour chart let's go to four hour and let's see how does this works in four hour because price is fractal in forex whatever happen in one minute will happen in four hour or 15 minutes or in one minute because one minute makes one hour one hour makes four hour and four hour makes daily chart so price is fractal in forex no matter in which time frame we are working or we are analyzing our pair so in four hour we have this as our bearish shorter block candle let me stretch this so this bullish candle is our order block candle so i mark this zone i will wait here till price reaches to our this zone then we will see how this price is moving in the zone then we will open our sell orders here 
I will not open directly sell orders from this zone. Once I will see how this price is reacting in the zone and then on the basis of the reaction, I will open my sell orders here in a smaller time frame. So this is how this works exactly every time in Forex in any time frame and in every pair. So if you get some information from this video which is useful to you in trading or you learned something new in this then please like subscribe this channel. If you don't watch our previous video then please watch out the previous video. I marked this link of the previous video in above i button. You can find out the part one of the order blocks. I cover what is order block, how do you mark the order block zones and bearish and order block, bullish order block. All of these things are everything in available in that video. You can visit that video and watch out the first part of this video. Thank you.